Hi everyone, my name is Matt Haynes. I'm an audiobook narrator and this is part of my series called Self-Improvement Paths. This is a uh, collection of ideas that I use to start my week, uh, one per week. So uh, I like to start my week with a mantra or a practice that I use that makes moving forward in my uh, self-development and in my career development makes it even more fun and a little easier. Examples I'm going to give are from my work as an audiobook narrator and also from my work as a narration teacher, but I think you can apply this stuff to just about anything that you're working on in your life. Give it a try. Let me know how it goes for you. This week's path expedition marching through technique is about am I stepping up or stepping down? We have uh, sometimes when uh, in a situation where there is choice involved, for example, if I'm in a work situation and something urgent comes up, then I don't really have to think about it. I just do it, right? One of the tougher things, however, is an act of will, especially when one has a choice. Okay, do I really want to do this or do I do this? I want to, I don't know what's best for me, that sort of thing. So, um, and also it can be difficult to determine if I'm really giving it my all or, or not. So what I've been thinking about is stepping up or stepping down. Am I, uh, is, it, is there a call right now for me to step up and do something that's a little out of my comfort zone, but I think may be necessary, and knowing that once I step up in this path, there's likely going to be a nice down waiting for me on the other side. That makes it very satisfying. Likewise, if I step down, knowing that I can just give myself that break, but then also gather strength for a new step up. What would this look like in narration? Well, I'll tell you something. I hate to warm up. I hate it. I just want to I just want to go in there and get the work done. Warming up seems superfluous. But guess what? It's really, really handy, really, really helpful. And I can feel it when I haven't warmed up. So for me, a step up, and I'll even pledge to do this tonight, a step up is to warm up. Now, that's followed usually by a wonderful feeling of looseness, preparedness, and ease going into the next activity. On the other hand, stepping down may be, uh, you know what, I have, um, I'm, I'm on a roll with this work. I can continue without a break. I just am going to step down and let myself glide. Same thing for students. Students stepping up may be taking that extra five to ten minutes, making sure that the noise floor in the uh, studio space that you're in is immaculately quiet, uh, checking the equipment, making sure everything is there before launching into the session. That can be followed by a wonderful feeling of assurance and security. On the other hand, stepping down may also be like, you know what, I've, I, I don't know yet, I don't know yet, I don't know yet, but I'm going to just continue practicing narrating and uh, deal with the tech stuff later. That can be a step, a step down. Stepping up or stepping down. That's what I'm going to be working on this week. I'll get back to you with my results. You get back to me with yours. Thank you for joining me. And as your narrator and teacher, I hope our paths cross again real soon.